Now, the authorities are, are threatening to take your kids away, right? Yeah, they are. Well, how do you feel about that? I'm pissed off, and it hurts. My children are my world. I would not hurt my children. Well, I think you did with the broken leg, right? Why are you here today? To prove I didn't hurt my child. And prove to prove who? To whom? To the doctors, to everybody, and to get my daughter help. It isn't just about me. My daughter needs Because help. everybody feels like you're being a bad mother. I don't care what everybody else thinks. Whoa, 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 whoa. You just said you do. I care you what the doctors. You want to prove to everybody. I don't care what my neighbors and, you know, even Danielle Your good friend that lives upstairs, that your older child and that, my, her well, child are friends. Well, my downstairs neighbor, yes. I don't care what she, I care that my child is getting the help she needs. How about the fact that your friend thinks that you're not doing right as a mother? You don't care? Well, obviously she's not a real friend, so. No, we whoa, whoa. Friends, right? We're okay. We're civil. We've had our issues. Yeah. She's the drama queen in the apartment. She's the drama queen in the apartment. Yes. But we're just discussing uh, her as a mother. Right. Uh, the child who, uh, you know, I'm informed by my producers, the doctor said that the child really can't, at nine months, pull itself up and break, fracture its leg under its own weight. Right. And this, if it's a baby chair, how far does she, how far does she fall? That isn't, it doesn't make any sense. What, what, and I know that that's why I'm what, here. Uh, what kind of floor was this that she fell on? There's carpet. Carpet? Oh, okay. Kind of like this? Yeah. Kind of like this. And how, show me with your hand how high she was when she fell. She was just standing. Show me with your hand. She's about this So fall, she so. fell all the way down? Boom! It wasn't just a fall. Y'all are talking like she just like, oh, no, okay, she, like this. She no, made a move. Le no, her move. ankle bent one way. Her knee bent the exact way. Okay, she okay, so where, on show it. me on your leg so you where the break it? is. It's right here. Right here. So what has that got to do with the ankle or the knee? I don't know. Nothing. And I'm not a doctor. Um, no. Now, obviously, if the, she fails, this, I would seriously affect yeah, your... Yeah, she needs to go to jail, and then kids need to get out of her home. So... Seriously. So, you have a five-year-old? Yes, yes, I have a five-year-old. You ever leave marks or bruises on the five-year-old? I have accidentally spanked my son. Oh, wow. And missed and got his back. Okay. Yes. So, yeah, you Stu, were... did you take your baby to the hospital the same day as you noticed the injury? Mm-hmm. You said yes, you told the truth. There you go. Next one. You should have told the truth. And I did. You should have told the truth. All okay. of them. All right, let's go. Have you ever hit your baby, and we're talking about the nine-month-old now, have you ever hit your baby causing marks, bruises, or injuries? You answer no. You did not tell the truth. Ooh. Ooh, okay, let, hold up. Let's see, let's see this. I know okay. you didn't tell the truth. No. Listen, do not touch her, okay? I understand. The anger. It breaks my heart. Steve. I, right, and I understand. I do this every day for a living, hearing terrible stories like this. And then the last question: Did you cause your baby's broken leg? Sure did. Did you cause your baby's broken leg? You answered no. And the result for that question is: You did not tell the truth. No, I didn't. Yeah. How is it lying? That's what you came here to prove that she wasn't lying about, right? Lying. Bro, I hope you go to jail, bro. I hope you go to jail. Your daughter, can you imagine the pain that that baby she must have stopped. felt breaking, breaking a leg at nine Didn't months? break my baby's leg. Okay. And do you not think I haven't stayed up late at night worrying about my because child? Because you did. I, you... Think, I think you stayed up late <gasps> worrying about you're going to get exposed. I would yeah, not have called on. Steve. Hey, I would not have called you if I had hurt my if I didn't have guilty people call my show, I wouldn't have a show. You got a show because y'all fake. No, because of people like you. I have you. a show. No. I have a show because I expose bad people, people. doing bad things. Mm -hmm. No, nah, y'all, no. Well, I'm, you know what? No, I'm, You're I'm going good. to lose your children, and you are exposed, so now the doctor's not wrong. You're wrong. You caused this. Is that why you were so paranoid about taking her to the hospital? Is that why you didn't go straight there? I didn't there? know. Because I didn't know what she was crying. Bro. 
So you took the test three times and you failed three times. Three times? And you know, here you did pit, you did tell the truth that you took the baby to the hospital on the same day. So you like some of the results, but not all of them. Sir, you brought us here. Why are you running? Why would I bring you here if I was lying? It's my life. life. Exactly. So why would you hurt her? Why? You caused something. You didn't prevent it. Why are you running? There's no point of running. OK. So this is the end of the show, of course. And again, you wanted to come on and prove everybody wrong. Yeah, I wanted to prove, prove I didn't break my well, baby's leg. But you didn't I prove swear. that. And now you're exposed for causing your uh, baby's injury. My Can heart I see and you? I was, I was trying to tell you, you know, maybe you did something, maybe you felt so overwhelmed, but no, you wouldn't even take that lifeline. So CPS is involved with their kids, which oh, they got. Oh, I'm gonna make sure CPS is involved. Their and kids are gone. More, see, now with this, all you're doing by not admitting to someone and saying, you know what, I did this, I did I that. Did. You made I up really a crazy, lying story. It, it, it's terrible when we have to root for the mother not to get her kids. Because that's a dangerous place for them. They're getting hit, they're getting smacked, they're getting their legs broke, they're not kids. being fed properly. Wow. And again, you're 25, you're not 18. You came on the show. You said you wanted to prove the doctors and everybody wrong while well, you just <laughs> exposed yourself. Right. And your kids are probably going to get taken away. All because you didn't do the right thing. And you're a liar. And that's the worst part. Instead of just admitting what you did, I didn't you hurt lied. my daughter. OK. You keep saying that, and maybe somebody will believe you. Will but, believe it you. but it ain't going to be a judge. It ain't going to be a caseworker. It ain't going to be the investigators and it certainly won't be the doctors. So good luck with that lie you're gonna keep telling. Uh, I wanna thank you and uh, I, I wish you all the best of luck, but obviously that's gonna it, go My nowhere. heart is broke, Steve. Just I understand, broke. but this- My daughter was premature, there's no way. There's no way, I knew, but I knew, she, she, just falling she, off a she, chair. She did the system a favor by giving them herself. evidence so that they can put her kids in a safer safe place. I hope so. That's the truth! Get the hell off my stage!